Run-down and empty lots could soon be turned into new housing. The city of Topeka and Shawnee County are working together on a plan to revitalize the area through tax foreclosures. KSNT News reporter Hannah Brandt talked to the people behind the plan to find out how it would work. She joins us live now. Hannah. Brooke, that's right. At tonight's city council meeting, county leaders addressed what they say is a growing problem with vacant lots. Whether it's abandoned buildings or half-finished subdivisions, they have a plan to fix those neighborhood eyesores. The plan is for the city to help the county identify about 50 abandoned and vacant properties that are ideal for building homes. Then the county will use a legal process to foreclose on them, and those vacant lots will be sold to new owners in a county auction. Well, we're really hoping that we can get these vacant lots of land sold and in the hands of someone who will do something with them right now. They're just sitting vacant. That auction would be open to everyone, but the county plans to market the property to developers specifically. They could come buy the lots and then the, obviously the idea would be that they would build new houses and complete these subdivisions that have just been sitting out there. And the city says there are major incentives for people to buy those lots. Not only could you have the benefit of a 10-year tax rebate on the construction of your home for the property taxes that resulted, but you could also potentially pick up a really nice lot to build your home on at a much reduced price. But the plan won't just benefit developers. Leaders say it's all part of a larger effort to beautify the area. So it's part of this momentum 2022. We're trying to address blight. We're trying to encourage neighborhood revitalization. And hopefully with new construction, we can complete these neighborhoods and make it, you know, Topeka and Shawnee County a great place to, to work and live. That plan is still in the beginning phases. The county says they've already started to identify those lots. They plan to foreclose in the spring and have the auction next fall. Live from downtown Topeka, Hannah Brandt. KSNT News. All right, thank you so much, Hannah. And the money made from the property auction would go back into county and city budgets.